We're having a little picnic. Not a picnic because we're not eating anything, but we're hanging out in the local park. I have some cashews. Oh yeah, we have we have nuts. <laughs> There's some food here. <laughs> it's so pretty here. It's my first time here. Ooh. And it feels like fall. So we we're just saying something happened this weekend where it finally feels like fall. The leaves have fallen and there's that smell, that dead leaf smell all around. And it's great. We're enjoying a nice day. We're gonna journal and draw. Chris is drawing. I'm gonna journal. My journal makes me feel like George Washington. Washington, Washington. <laughs> Six foot ten, fucking killing the fun. He's coming. He's coming. <laughs> because of the the little feather pen, but also because it's squishy and it feels important. And then I have to show you this. I'm so glad I did this. I collaged the inside of my journal. And when I'm thinking about what to write about, I look at this and it puts me in like a great little mindful state. I like this, it's like a picture of New York City and it says find your quiet place because even in a big city you can find your peaceful quiet place. My little George Washington journal. Your life? Requires your mindful presence in order to live it and be present in the class of life. To your present. <laughs> Are you present? <laughs> in town to take our picture. He works for the daily local newspaper and he wanted to take our picture sitting in the grass here and that was a very nice moment. I feel like we um, earned, <laughs> I don't know, not earned, um, I feel like we're really part of the community now. So we'll have to look for that in the paper. It's cute. We've been doing some work in here. So I'm gonna show you the bedroom. This is what it's looking like. Rock found his little sunny spot. I was very concerned that he wasn't going to be sunny enough in here, but we got some sun. There he is. One thing we did recently, we added curtains. So I hung them with those little hooks where they're like hanging down a little so it gave them like a couple extra inches and it's kind of perfect it's they're hanging like an inch or two above the ground but i think it's okay and i like how these look a lot better than the curtains that have the hole in the top and it looks like a shower curtain so these i like a lot and i was worried about the material and like the color white but i do like this color white in here so it worked out well and we have black accents with the curtain rods that were already here in the apartment and the light above is black as well. So we have little like black features coming in and we have a little black chair in the corner, like a little reading nook next to the bookshelf and then a black picture frame in the middle of the room, 
which I really like. So we have things tying in the black, and then we do plan to get a dresser. Really, we're taking my old dresser from childhood from my mom's house. We're gonna paint it a blackish color. And something that we did too that I really like is we put the bench that was in our living room in our old place and we put it in front of the bed, which I love. I love having the bench in front of the bed. I think it's a really nice look. And underneath I have some baskets that hold the sheets and pillowcases because we don't have too much storage here. It's a pretty small place. So I like how that looks too. It's like a useful little space for those things to live. Changing the bed, it's just right there under the bench. So it's kind of perfect. This is what it looks like. Chris made this bench and it matches the little bed frame that we got pretty well too. And those are the little baskets underneath. They're a little overflowing right now, so don't look too great. I thought about maybe getting deeper ones, but I'm just going to go with these for now. I like the color of them. And then the rug, too. We put the rug in. That was one of the first things we did. On camera, it's coming up a little gray, but it's actually very green in person. So we also have these green pillows to bring out the green as well. And these, I was proud of myself because... We had these really ugly pillows that came with our couch that we got a few years ago. And we were going to get rid of them, but then I remembered there's such a thing as pillowcase covers. And I got these. And we didn't have to buy new pillows, we just got the cases. And I think it looks great. And it's a perfect color green, it's like olive green. And it brings out the green in the rug <laughs> even more. Another thing that's great about these curtains on the little hooks is that it slides really nicely and easily. And that's what I wanted. Like, you don't want to be, like, struggling with curtains to try to, like, get them across. You just want it to be easy. So, these are really easy and great. And I like them a lot. I like how they look. They kind of pleat the curtain when you have them up to the side. So, we're making some progress in the apartment. We've done a lot, it feels homey, and I wanted to share some apartment updates. So those are um, some new things in the bedroom which feel nice and homey, so excited about those things. smooth. I 
and the water so blue. Wow, those are big. Yeah, the stump. I just took a picture of this stump last time. I think it was in. No. Wow. doing the same thing we did earlier today. Well, that's, oh, We're piping reading. over was my first look up. And that was special for me because piping over. I used to struggle mightily on the, oh. <laughs> Are you vlogging? Yeah. Sorry. Doing the same thing we were doing earlier today. We're reading and sitting in the, not a park this time, but the beach. This is exactly the kind of thing we moved up here to do, to be able to do this all the time, and whenever we wanted. It's like the perfect day to be outside in the park, and now we're at the beach, and it just feels so good. It feels good to finally like get the apartment in order a little bit, make it feel homey and like our own, and then it feels so good to have access to places like this and I just feel so grateful and looking back on the footage of when we were moving I was like so nervous to move and I was afraid to let go of that time in my life like I thought if I moved away from Boston I would be letting go of my youth and I would no longer have access to like fun young things and it's just not true and I can have my own fun life up here and it just looks a little different but better like it suits me better and it just feels so good to feel that now be on the other side of it and know what it's like to live here I got seagull friends coming up <laughs> it's just the perfect night too the colors are so vibrant and beautiful I'm just loving loving life right now but like that's how it is I guess you know like you don't know what is on the other side until you get there and um, now I know and it feels great and happy and like I said this these are the kind of things we wanted to do that's why I moved up here and it just feels in this moment so good to be doing it and that's all I want to say <laughs> probably gonna end this little vlog here um, this day was a lot of the same with just kind of hanging out checking out local places and reading and relaxing but also getting life together I wanted to show you those apartment updates and there will be more to come because we're getting the apartment more and more put together so there will be more updates there too. So I hope you are also enjoying your day, whatever time you're watching this. And it's just so good to document this time of my life. I just really like looking back on it and remembering all the things that I felt and experienced. And it's just nice to have a visual representation of my life. And it really does feel like a little like diary entry, <laughs> a visual diary entry. And that's how, that's the only reason why I'm doing this. Because I just like it. I like capturing all of this. Alright, I'm going to go now and enjoy the beach and the beautiful sun. And I think the sun is going to be setting soon. I'll show you that. Here it comes. Thank <laughs> you.